Wait, then I was hoping. I was hoping I was just right next to it, you know? Just went a touch too far to the left or right. Well, touched too, touched too far to the left. And down here. Up, over, down. Over this way. And this is over there, so I fight out. I figure some uh, class probably has a quest sending them over here. That's why I, you know, why this is here and has all this going on, and yet we've seen nothing. It's maybe mage? Shaman? Actually, I'm, I was guessing shaman because the elements, the elementals. But, um, maybe mage. Surprised if rogue. This way. This lady clearly has not looked in the mirror before she came out today. Like, my god, woman, your hair's all over the place. And just a spell directly called haste. Huh. Oh, that's exactly what it says on the tin. Well, technically, it was uh, Queen Ashara who did this to you. Oh, nice. Uh, make it a turd. Yeah, I don't think you can ever be so lucky as to get a third one. Okay, at the same spot. Not even except, you know, just like it it doesn't ha they don't have spawn at the same spot, but it's like instead of there it's here. I don't think you'd ever be so lucky as to get three in a row. I could see it, I would and I'd love it to happen to me, but I don't s uh, I'm not gonna put money on it. And I was hoping I could avoid fighting her. There we go. Woot. No book. They are kind of rare. But still, it's... You want to check. Because you can get three... Oh, like up to three extra things from it. This guy, presumably. Oh, yeah. And now we're done here. The light smites our foes. No book, but we found a spirit. Which is just as good. Uh, given that the books have a fair chance of only giving you one node, the spirit is actually better in some ways. Well, it's actually better in a lot of ways. Um, you probably have to find more than one node, maybe even the tree, to match the spirit. Or, well, actually, no, you could match the spirit with two nodes. But, still. Uh, okay, there's a new one over here. Old Coast Road.
Just go do the heal that person at some stage. Bears. Um, hold on. I wish there were boars because boars would be much more. Well, I could get the ribs off them. Wonder, does anyone else see these? This Boros and two knights just chilling out here? Three knights? Maybe it's me just because of phasing. It's weird that they're still here after all this time. Can't blame me for for doing that. Cannot blame me. And plus, they, it's not like they've missed out on anything because I did. I just claimed a entirely separate set of uh, fragments off the body that they wouldn't have taken. The new alliance, eh? Hold on, I need to take this name down. I'm just, if I see people playing and they've got an, a, you know, a, you know, a guild, I'm taking the name down so I can try and join the guild. Or, well, I might necessarily try and join all guilds, you know? I may just look at, uh, you know, look at them and think, eh, they're not for me, like if it's an RP guild or whatever. Or if it's heavily focused on PvP. Ah, poison. I really want that one that gave me three. <laughs> oh, there's no scream and sound from the ghost, but you can hear its body fall. Second book? I wonder if they can see this. They'll never find this buried here. You were saying. talk and I, I illuminated someone to the mysterious new thing that that happened. And apparently yeah you can avail of other people's ones. I did not know that. 
paid me to keep an eye out for other people's uh, archaeology then. Because those books seriously help. Because they allow you to get much more out of a spot than you can otherwise normally get. Because you can get an extra node or tree and it doesn't count towards the dig site progress. Okay, nothing here. Over here then. Nothing there. Here. Wait, I should have asked is this guild recruiting? Should have enough now. You just so short, but I have these. I know I could sell these and make a bit, but I just want these done. Okay, I can't make any more. Um, I'm done. I. When did this finish? I have no idea. I kind of lost track there. I, I might have finished ages ago, but I kind of just kept going. Uh, might want to check the video. That might have been the last one, or that might have been the second, like, two over. Alright, you fucking slave driver. You better be fucking happy, or I'll shove all this quiet wine down your fucking gob. The eternal sun guides us. Halen listens to, uh, to your account of what you earned. Um, very interesting. There's a lot of the same shit here, aren't there? Aren't there? Uh, very interesting. If what, you've if, if what you've said is true, then I believe I know where the location of the artifact is. I've marked the location of the artifact on your map. It's in a rather hostile location, so I'd like you to go there and find it. When you've uh, recovered it, bring it back to me so I can discern its power. Oh okay, yeah, send me in. You're burlier, dammit. Goit. Ancient highborn artifact. And for that we'll get the Starlight Beacon. Draws the outline of a starlight field. Players can inside the starlight field can fly. Ah, cute little toy. Depending on the area, I could actually see that having like limited, limited utility. There's these two. Eh, let's help him out. I like these, these two. This demon is too powerful. I can't contain it for long. And we are not strong enough to defeat it by ourselves. I can't hold it any longer. We are ready. Let it come. Doomward Kazrock. Mars, you prideful glut. You almost got me killed. I I can I kinda like the banter between these two. I really hope we get to see more of it. What's Finn Peak? Felwing. Felwing's chilling up here, apparently. Oh. Look, this one is not my fault. How was I supposed to know those demons would believe me? Uh. Watch the skies. I sense them coming. You were saying. Hmm. Ah, here's Falwing, breaking the walls of physics. Just flying through solid fucking matter.
Yeah, there's a Legion communicator. He must have said something on it. My life is dedicated to destroying the Burning Legion. He despawned. This guy didn't. Maybe I should chill out here for a moment. You, you demon toying fool! You've compromised our position. The other guy has to respond. Hmm. Strange. Five ranked arena matches? This ain't ranked. These are. And I need to join a group to win these. To, to do those. Orja? Okay, I've never kn known you before. Your destiny lies within my pearl, Draenei. Okay, there's uh, uh, Chris Kelke and his pet Julian. Keep, uh, keep back, don't go near that pearl. Byron Hogo and Colin, his pet goat. And here is Jared Coldstone. It's so, it was so, it's so shiny, I couldn't help myself. Good day to you. Don't worry about us. Just clear out these naga. Have a good the pearl, uh, the pearl appears to be temporarily drained of its power. Should I get ye out? Apparently not. Oh wait, no, no, bad, bad fell. Oh no, wait, this is the site I'm meant to work at. <laughs> I, I forgot for a moment there. Rice are huge. Sadly, those Morocs had nothing. Christ. Who gives their slaves nothing? Like, what happens when someone comes along and kills them? Then they don't get any reward for it. Some people. I just don't know how the world fucking works. Oh no, he's doing minuscule amounts of damage. Whatever will I do? Nothing, because the hot I have for getting hit heals me. And just negates what he's after doing. I bore an archaeology find. It's actually after graying out. Don't think I've hit, uh, hit 100, though. I have! I've maxed out archaeology. Christ, didn't think I would see that day. Archaeology is typically quite boring. Gurg! And it runs off. by these guys, they look like rogues. Um, I guess maybe the, the uh, rogue quest takes them here. I found it. And now this is no longer a site I can mine. It appears to be some sort of device, but... To what, uh, to what, but to what purpose? We are unable to tell. 
It, it appears... It appears to be some sort of device, but to what purpose you're unable to tell. Yes. I read it right. But yeah, I do like, do like the banter between that demon hunter and that uh, warlock. It's, it's, it's a nice little thing, you know? It's a nice little flavor. Um, I would have liked to have seen more of them. You just get to see bits of them here and there. and maybe, maybe it's best to keep it like that, you know, so it doesn't have to say it's welcome. But at the same time, I know I, I like to see more. Special delivery for a uh, Mr. Blood Watcher. Blood Watcher, eh? The reckoning is at hand. Uh huh. Interesting. I didn't think Blood Watcher was so well liked that it got named. Someone got named after it. Used to be a quest out here for Drain Eye Shamans, or any shaman went here to do. The, well, any line shaman went here. But uh, since with the removal of a uh, lot of class quests. There's nothing there now. I really hope in Battle for Azeroth they fix up shamans. They're missing most of, most of their fucking totems. Like, as a... Like, before, you used to get a wide selection of totems. Even if you weren't playing, like, an elemental shaman. I think if you play elemental, you get a bit more. But now, you get a lot less. No art skin totems. No taunting totems. No... Uh... Searing totems. Well, actually, maybe Searing Totems exist, but uh, there's a lot less totems. And a lot of the totems they have are a lot more class. Uh, uh, well, spec, uh, spec reliant. Before they were much more uh, equal opportunity. The dark times will pass. Uh, perhaps we can use this artifact to turn the tide of this war in our favor. Let's see what you found. Talon studies the artifact for some time and lets out a sigh. Useless. It's nothing more than a Starfield generator. Probably from some academy before the war. Uh, you can have a back pal and I. I have no use for it. We will have justice. A new Bellore de la Nav. A beacon of hope. And that is finally fucking done. Ooh, I sent Yeah, I sent three of my guys on these. Eesh. So with that done now, honestly, with that done, I feel like I'm at a loss. Okay, what the hell, what the hell do I do now? I don't feel comfortable trying to do my own one, you know? So, yeah. I'm well, like, trying to be the ray leader of some group. I try that mythic, with mythic plus and that backfired in my fucking face. I... I just wish I was in a guild. My... Peace, friend. I can figure out what. Part of me is thinking maybe I should try that, join that other guild. I can just explain that I felt, uh, you know, I was gone. You know, I, I moved over to join. I've been here since before, you know, the expansion. But then the, you know, stuff happened, and I didn't. It took a while to join, and I felt too awkward. To, Probably accept extreme embarrassment, you know. Make one of these, but I'm not really sure it's a good move. <sighs> Just it costs so much, you know, and it's not fully upgraded.
this. Standing in starlight. Okay, that's trippy. And we get turned into this. It's kind of. I think that looks like a human. Like, look, Rain Eye. Yeah, I've got feet. Got turned into a human. Well, maybe it's meant to be a night elf. It makes sense of being. wanting to be. a. Be trying to be an elf. But I could see that having a limited degree of utility. In, uh, like, if you're trying to just clamber over something. But I was figuring... That... Um, it'll be a toy, and not an item. I'll stick it in my bank later on. Okay, I'm gonna head back to Dahl. I know what I'm gonna do next. I'm gonna head to Pandario, like I was saying I was gonna do earlier. We're going to head to the Tiller's Marketplace and see who's there. Well, actually, we'll, we'll just head around that region. Well, we'll certainly be heading there, but we'll head around that region and turn shite into people. Uh, some people basically want particular goodies. Uh, well, and they'll all accept any item you give them, but others will like it more so than others. Apparently you can get these via Time Warp badges. Oh wait, I, I remember now. I knew there was a portal here in Dahl. Oh, for a moment I thought there was... The, these had all just since these had all been placed into Tomb of Sejeris, they'd all been replaced with this, but no. Yeah, they kind of overstated it with these two pillars. I guess it's for the symmetry of it all. I am pretty hyped for the expansion. I just wish I was in a guild and I could have gotten all this stuff already done. It just, I was sewing most of this stuff and I didn't need a guild. Now I just realize I do and it's too fucking late. You know here with the Veil of Eternal Blossoms, it's kind of fucked up now. I wonder what, it, uh, like, when people are initially coming in, they have to do a, a quest to come in. What are they going to see? Are they going to see it fucked up or not? Because if you're going to see it fucked up, then I hope they've changed the character's, you know, reactions to it. Then again, Parmy hopes they have it. Parmy hopes the player sees what it used to look like. Basically, the uh, Ishaw got released and fucked up the Veil. Tons of people died. They basically got a faction. Um, you can't do their quests at all. They're like, they would, uh, when you reach different rep levels, you could get to do a, a quest with a faction. You can't do it anymore. I got it done on the last day over here in Europe. We got our our, our stuff got up gets updated a day after years uh, after the Americans. So I got it done just a mo. Uh, basically, barely got it done, and then the next day this happened because of garage um, need it for the gorgeous achievement bottle tornado oh but anyway um, sharp eye mr. smite's brass compass mr. smite but anyway um, I wonder what they'll see because like, they come in via the golden stair over there what will they see Will they see this, or will they see what how it used to look? York Sharp Eye. 92 human mode. You! What are you doing here? He's, 
Oh. Okay. I feel kind of bad for killing him. He's playing with a little booty. Oh. But yeah, he's got Mr. Smite's brass compass. Release the memories of a long lost first mate. And check out that noise. Yes. Memory of Mr. Smite. Oh, that looks that looks awesome. But um yeah, this is a nod back to the original Dead Mines. Quit. You're over here. Ah, uh, Spirit of Misty Falls. Vestige of Pride. Aged Balsamic Vinegar. Anyway, we have to head down here. Uh, I barely, I so barely got this done. As you can see here, there's some daily quests. Work Order, Shadow Pan, Ol the Olga Celestials, Operation Shield Wall. Um, I got this done via the Golden, uh, the, the faction that was up here that got destroyed. They're like right here, the Golden Pre Golden used to be. Actually, you can actually see it on the map now. That's strange, I swore you couldn't before. Like, it used to be there, but as you can see, it got wrecked. And all the NPCs that were there are dead. And, and as a, to spit on the wound some more. Oh, this is the arenas. No, wait. Yeah, these are... No, sorry, those are the dungeons. I just didn't recognize some of them. A gate of the setting sun. I'm not sure if I've ever done that one. Yeah, I really seem to miss out on a lot of content here. I remember tanking a um And this Hand Quest or White Main we saw her the other day. Um I remember tanking that for someone. As a DPS character, I think. Siege of Ogremar. Fallen Protectors. Rook, uh, Stone Toe, He, Soft Foot, and P Priest, Sun, ten Tenderheart. The Golden Lotus and Shadow Pan Guardians of the Vale of Eternal Blossoms were caught in the epicenter of the devastating blast that scarred the Veil vale and torn apart by the dark energies. Uh, their spirits linger in the place they once protected, confused and tormented by their failure. So yeah, you would used to work alongside these three. They would give you quests, you would go do them, and Garage killed them. And now you have to fight them to put the, them to rest. Uh, but anyway, uh, yeah, down here uh, at your farm, I think it was added in later on. Uh, you get a farm here, and you gradually unlock all the squares of it. And here's my farm. Yeah, you can gradually unlock all the squares of it. And over, and they eventually added in work orders. And I don't have a work order here for any uh, for the Golden Lotus, but I have a work order here for like Operation Shield Wall. So I could go uh, plant eight witch uh, witchberry seeds, and when they are, you know, har you know, harvestable and done, I harvest them, and I just get it. A nice little bit of extra rep with Operation Shield Wall. Um, so I was doing like all the day, the Gold Lotus dailies. I was doing this, and I just barely managed to eke out Exalted on the last day. That's basically what I was all getting at. I used this to help me out. So uh, I feel like I'm kind of went on a very long tangent there over nothing. But yeah, basically, it basically put simply, this helped me the fuck out. It was very fantastic. I am kind of annoyed at myself. I feel like I really did go on that fucking tangent there. Um, I do kind of apologize. 
Oh, wait. I can now also do this. Um, work order, a gold lotus 2. I harvest 8 ripe uh, white turnip plants and provide 40 white turnips for a uh, golden lotus. And I get 11 gold, 40 silver, and this. Hmm. Uh, so yeah, just doing this gets you a bit of rep, and it was actually really bloody helpful with getting to Exalted. I barely managed to eke it out, and I'm glad for that, because it's now gone. Uh, if I go over here to Legacy, Eternally in the Veil. Uh, like I said, this is removed. Um, well, sorry. Uh, these were the quests you used to be able to do. Uh, you get them every time you, every so often, as you gain rep. With uh, one of these being the final one. It was also relevant to the, you know, the Thunder Isle quest line. Because one of the things th you deal with in these quests was in the Thunder Isle quest line. It was stolen, I think, if memory serves, because I think I might, I might have forgotten. I'm not sure. Also, see these. These were also removed. I don't know why this one doesn't give rep, but these do. But yeah, these have been removed as well. Anyway, I've gone on a fucking tangent there, and I feel kind of shitty about that. But yeah, um, there's this little farm here. You can gain rep with all the different factions. So it's, it's really handy. You just come in, you do a little bit of work, and you leave. And... You come back the next day, you harvest the stuff, and you do it again, and you're gradually building rep with the factions. You don't need to go do their dailies or anything. Of course, that would take for fucking ever, but you can do it that way if you want. Um, so, yeah. Do fucking ask going on a tangent there, but whatever. I managed to become best friends with this guy, because he... he predicts the most productive thing. Um, so, you know, that's why I ha Actually, wait. I have these here for the shadow path. Oh, shit. Um, I was just figuring, eh, while I'm here, why not do it? But I kind of messed myself over there. You know, I could actually get used to have my character looking like this. Is there a post box here? Probably one up here in the village. There's also Lolo. You. Greetings, wanderer. You ever go just go walking for no reason at all, just to see what's on the other side of the hill? Ma says I got busy feet and upside down brain to boot. But I think maybe she's the one that got it all backwards. Okay, it's just go do a quest in an area. I will be handling all those when I come here to Pandaria. Okay. And now if we come back over here. I don't need to do this, but I'm just doing it because I can. The crate sits empty, awaiting your crops. Throw the golden, uh, throw the white load, white turnips into the crate. A gold lotus representative will be along shortly for pickup. Golden lotus defender of 110. <laughs> and uh, since I uh, since I hit exalted, I can't gain any rep with the guys. But uh, there you go. We're in desperate need of these turnips. Thank you so much. The Golden Lotus is in your